so let's sketch a graph of this equation right here. Um, it's a sign. Oh, there's a lot of decimals, small, small numbers like in the tenths. Well, let's see what happens. So there's my midline at 0.7. So if I'm at a height of 0 0.7, there's, uh, that's that's where my middle is going to be. Uh, this 0.2, that's my my stretch in, in a in a vertical direction. So 0 0.2. So that means I'll if I go 0.2 in this direction, I'll be at 0 0.9. If I come back up, uh, oh wrong direction, sorry. If I go this way, it'll be 0 0.9. And if I go down 0 0.2, it should be 0 0.5. All right, keep going from there. Um, sine. I know that sine uh, typically at, at zero is at zero. So I'm going to start it here and have it do that. We sometimes loosely say that sine starts in the middle, but it doesn't really start. You know, it goes on forever in both directions. So I have these y values for these points. So now what I need is some x values. And the way I'm going to get that is by figuring out this period. So uh, 10 pi. That appears typically uh, 2 pi. So how many times does 10 pi go into 2 pi? Those go uh, 1 fifth, which is the same as 0 0.2. Since the other things are in decimals, I might as well throw this one into a decimal. So that means my period is 0 0.2. So from 0 to 0 0.2 is when this thing starts repeating itself. Uh, half of 0.2 is 0.1. Half of 0.1 is 0 0.05. And so these jumps will be by, these jumps from here to here will be by 0 0.05, sorry, 0 0.05, 0 0.05. So this will be uh, 0.15 and then 0.2. Oh, still going from there. Now I, I need to shift everything and it gets shifted to the left 0.3. So what I'm going to do is subtract 0.3 from everything. So 0 minus 0.3 is negative uh, 0.3. 0.05 minus 0.3 is negative 0.25. This is a negative 0.2. This is going to be a negative uh, 0.15. And this is going to be a negative 0.1. Great. So let's keep going from here. Uh, these are my x values then. So for example, this value, I know the x this point, I, I know the x component is negative 0.3 and the y component is, is 0.7. This is negative 0 0.25, uh, 0 0.9. This one is negative 0 0.2, 0 0.7, Oop. Uh, negative 0 0.15, 0 0.5, and then the last point would be negative 0.1, um, oh, 0.7. And there's my graph. Use it well.